My name is Ben Ball, and you probably recognize me pushing fancy whips, stunting in the nightclubs, or sitting course at the Laker games. But the rest of the world knows me as the jeweler to the stars, Ben Ball. So tonight I got a call from my boy Benji Madden. Me and him have a lot of history. We're in a crew together, AMC. We usually hang out. It's not about jewelry, you know, but I think he hit me about some jewelry. See you, buddy. Let's come over here. All right, cool. Yeah, this is our little spot. We do all the, like, production stuff. We've been having a lot of fun in here. I hit up uh, my boy, and I was like, yo, man, it's crazy. I haven't seen Benji. And then you hit me up. Every time I talk to you, you're in Vegas with, like, Mayweather. <laughs> we take Ben Baller where we can get Ben Baller. Well, what, what, you, what do you have in mind? Like, what's going on? Me and Joel are working on a new record right now. When we finish, I always get Joel, like, a, like a present. Joel is a gun enthusiast. I know this. We used to do the big chains. Like, you're the one that got us into it. Listen, bro, the stop. Whole, stop. Like, stop. Before you get into all the DMV. Not to say, like, some big, like, like um, ketchup bottle or <laughs> mustard, mustard bottle yeah. is not classy. <laughs> I was thinking just, like, a little bullet. Do a 45 caliber. I could do black diamonds. Keep it real understated. Hella muted. Or like, a chain or something. OK, that's dumb. Budget, probably, like, three racks. Ain't going to be nothing crazy. What does three racks mean? I forget the <laughs> term for that. Is that three, three? zero, 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 three thousand. All right, yeah. Chill, Perfect. you know what I mean? Do you have a time frame? Like when, I mean, when? like, our birthday's coming up. That's a done deal. I never worry with you, man. Like, sooner the better. Beautiful. 10.44 AM, I'm headed down to my store now. Time limited isn't no big deal, nothing like that. The price issue is, with friends of mine, I might charge him 10% over cost. I might even take a loss on it. He might be wearing this when he's on TMZ. You know, I gotta tell Jeff what the price I quoted is and just make sure that we get, you know, our employees paid. What's up, man? What's up, fool? Chillin'. Hey, last night I saw with uh with Benji Madden. For what? You know who Benji Madden is or no? That white boy. What was he? A rock star dude with oh, the brother okay. that looked like him. <laughs> he knows! Okay, good. Yeah, so I see Benji and he wants to get Joel a present uh -huh. with the brother. We're gonna do a 40 cal bullet, but we're gonna do a black diamonds, you know? Fully flooded, everything? Full, everything. Even the coach, you know. How much you charge him? <laughs> Don't give me that look. How much you charge him? <laughs> no, I know. We're supposed to charge him like five or something, but I just said three. Because you know it's my homie. He gives me extra. Good, for free, he gives me extra good charge. Free every day. You know what I mean? Charge you inside the coach like this. Oh, inside each other. Yeah, three thousand. Don't worry about it. Okay. Okay. Sexy. I love you. Whatever. All right, man. Uh -huh. The process of making Benji Madden's bullet piece. I give Jimmy a forty caliber real bullet, and then from there he makes a mold. He cuts the wax, sends it to casting. Once it sends to casting, it's in gold. Once we get it finished, we give it to Chucky. Chucky sets his diamonds in it. After Chucky's finished setting diamonds in it, Chucky's going to black roading emit a few times. Once Chucky's finished black roading emit, send it to polishing. After polishing, it's ready for delivery. Jeff, when you're finished, Mac, I need to talk to you. Jesus Christ, dude. What the f is real? What are you looking for? I need Benji, the bullet. He said Chucky Sewell is done. Where is it? Is that done? Oh, hold on. <laughs> this is the one? Why are you wearing it, dude? I like it. Man, come on, man. I'm playing games, bro. What do you mean? Give it to me, dude. I gotta go. Didn't you tell me to wear it? Yeah, I told you to wear it. I told you, you to put it inside oh your butt. Oh, my lord. You think we should have PVD or no? No, it looks fine like that. You said you wanted that metal rusty, but. All right, we're good, man. Benji hit me up from Australia and he wanted to see what's going on with this. He doesn't know I finished a day early. Well, I'm on my way up right now to the penthouse and I'm gonna drop off this bullet from Joel. We're a day early, so we'll see what happens. <laughs> Ben Baller. What's up, buddy? Come on in. Yeah. What's good, man? Music, travel, music, travel, music. How was Australia? It was good? It was good. Yeah, how you been? I've been good, man. Oh, I got a lot of cats I gotta do some. Of course you do. Sport. I do, I mean, you know, yeah, I know. Hustle. I already know. Mr. Gunman. Unveiling a, a Ben Baller piece is always. Ah, uh, here we go. Let's see what you got. Oh.
dude. I wanted to. I wanted. I'm just kidding. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh, man, it's you great. scared me, bro. I was like, what are you talking it's about? Great. It's great, dude. 40 cal bullet. So dope, man. Fully flooded. We even put a solitaire black diamond in the tip of the bullet. You know All in point. I mean, everything black gold. Man, it's awesome. This is dope. Joel's gonna love it. No, I'm go. excited, bro. What? Ave is crashing and shit. <laughs> Christmas is around the corner, so. <laughs> Christmas. Man. Yeah. I'm in. Thanks, brother. I'll see ya. Thanks, fam. Whenever I come to any kind of big decisions in my life where I need to buy jewelry, he's definitely the guy that I call. Yeah, he's always been a great friend. It's cool when you have a friend who's, who you also enjoy their work too, their art. The bullet is sick. A grown man can wear it and it's not silly. Very tasteful. At the same time, it's like hard as nails. It's unique. Yeah, I might have to keep it. I don't know. I'm in a good mood, you know? I mean, how much better could my life really be? Every time I complain about shit, and then I see like a seven inch person in a shopping cart being pushed by like a 14 inch person, it's you know, it's like my life is all right, dude. Like, I can't really be that mad. It's just nice that this is done. Got more jewelry to handle. Another piece and another day.